No, you do not do that. You've just told me you don't do that. If the, if the customer lets me know there's a trade involved in it, one of the things that I want to know, you know, if you're trading it in, how long have you had the car? Okay, okay. Yeah, okay. These, are, um, these are questions that I'm asking. Okay, the, uh, yeah, I'm, I tell them it's like, you know, the reason why I want to know is, is so that we can have your car appraised while we're driving this one. Good, I good. Because I use that quite a few times. Good. Now I'm going to give you. I just want to know if it's paid for us, so if we got to pay it off. I want the VIN number. The, uh... <laughs> Where are you doing that? I mean. I understand. Mm -hmm. let's, let's, let's think out of the box mm -hmm. here for a second. Betty, I see that you've got some dings and dance like everybody else in the state of Tennessee. This is evidence you are a perfectly normal human being. You know, Betty, you may have coverage that will fix all these dings and dents for you at absolutely no cost to you. And by the way, they're about 50 to 100 bucks to fix each one depending upon the severity. Um, but if you've got this coverage, it'll make your vehicle worth a whole lot more. Did you happen to purchase paintless dent repair when you bought this vehicle? It's helping you sell down. Oh, just, you're, no, no, you're, you're, you're no, missing, no, you, you're missing yeah. this, okay? You'll get it in just a second. The number one response to that is, what is it? What is it? The number two response is, no, I didn't. The number three response is, damn, wish I had of, because it would have made my car worth more. By the way, did I just devalue your car? Yeah. Did I say a bad word about it? No. No, I didn't. I can take a customer and completely reduce their expectations and never say a cross word about their car or truck. But you need to know how to do it. How many keys do you have to your vehicle, Kevin? One. Oh, my gosh, Kevin, where is the other one? No chance of finding it. Wait a minute. Did you happen to purchase a key replacement policy? What's that? And then no. Well, Kevin, had you purchased a key replacement policy, it would have replaced the key for you. By the way, those keys are like little mini computers. They cost two, three, four hundred bucks. Literally, the more keys your vehicle has, the more it's worth. Not to worry, your next vehicle comes with key replacement complimentary for six months. Do you see where I'm going here? Yes. Does this make sense? I'm giving them a realistic expectation. Do dings and dents devalue a vehicle? Yes, yes they do. Um, only having one key. That hurts the value of a vehicle. Scraped up wheel, alloy wheel. That hurts the value of a vehicle. Star in the windshield. That hurts the value of a vehicle. Does the customer know this? No, no they don't know it. Or if they do, they pretend they don't. They, pre they pretend they don't. They pretend they don't. They'll all tell you that my car is an My car's car is BF. And here's what happens. They go to KBB, all right? And, and the, the husband is on KBB, and he sees excellent, very good, good, fair, and poor. Honey, what kind of conditions are our car in? Very good or excellent? Excellent, click. You know what percentage of the vehicles out there are in excellent condition? No. 3%. They're the ones that someone bought 36 months ago, took it home, put it in the garage, cover it up, and then bring it back. They bring it back to trade it in. That's an excellent vehicle. It's showroom. How many of those do you see? Very, very few. So doing an early trade walk, asking them about keys, dings, dents, scrapes on the alloy wheels. Um, uh, Anthony, did you purchase a service contract with the vehicle that you're trying to trade in? Okay, that's too bad, Anthony. If you purchased a service contract, two things happen right now, both good for you. Number one, when they appraise the vehicle later on, they're going to take a deep dive into the mechanical condition. Um, if there's mechanical issues, chances are a service contract would have fixed them for you at no cost to you, making your car worth more. And if your car is perfect like we hope it is, well, shoot, by the laws of the state of Tennessee, you'd be due a refund for any unused miles or terms, something you really should consider with your next vehicle. By the way, Betty, you'll be glad to know that the Motor Trend Certified Vehicle you're looking at comes 
with a limited warranty for six months or 7,500 miles, and you can always extend that coverage. You know what you might See, that is the single most negative thought anyone you. has ever I'm given me. You. It has because never happened. I'm not devaluing devalue your trade. I'm, I'm, I'm talking straight up to you. I come out to look at a car, you ain't sold it to me yet. Um, okay, you know, that, that's a great point. First of all, I'm going to take a customer to see the vehicle as fast as they want to go see that vehicle. I will take them straight to the vehicle. Um, I probably should talk about meet and greet right now, okay? Meet and greet me.